It was April the 41st, <laughs> being a quadruple leap year. I was driving through downtown Atlantis. My Barracuda was in the shop, so I was in a rented stingray and it was overheating. <laughs> so I pulled into a shell station. They said I'd blown a seal. <laughs> While they were doing that, I walked over to a place called the Oyster Bar, a real dive. I was feeling good. I even dropped a sand dollar in a box for Jerry Squids. <laughs> for the halibut. <laughs> well, the place was crowded. We were packed in like sardines. And the stage was surrounded by screaming groupers. Probably there to see the bass player. <laughs> One of them was this cute little yellowtail. And she's giving me the eye. <laughs> but she said things I just couldn't fathom. She was too deep. Seemed to be under a lot of pressure. Bowie, could she drink? She drank like a... She drank a lot. I said, what's your sign? She said, aquarium. I said, great, let's get tanked. She threw me that same old line. Not tonight, I got a haddock. And she wasn't kidding either, because then came the biggest, meanest looking haddock I'd ever seen come down the pike. He was covered with muscles. He came over to me and said, listen, shrimp, don't you come trolling around here. I turned to him, I said, ah, baloney. <laughs> You're just being shellfish. Well, the haddock hits me with a sucker punch. I catch him with a left hook. He eels over. Well, the yellowtail was impressed with the way I landed her boyfriend. She came over to me, she said, hey, big boy. You're really a game fish. What's your name? I looked around, I said, uh, Marlin. <laughs> well, from then on, we had a whale of a time. I took her to dinner, I took her to dance, I bought her a bouquet of flounders. And then I went home with her. And what did I get for my trouble? <laughs> a case of the clams.